Hi, I'm Graham Walsh from Polycom, and today I'm going to show you our native integration from our Microsoft Link client straight into the Polycom Room Systems and Environment platform from Polycom. Make it very easy for users to have just one click away. So they have their uh, user interface, which is Link, they're used to doing. They can do IM and presence from it and see who's online. But also what we've done at Polycom is integrated the Polycom Room Systems straight into the Microsoft Link environment. So you're able to do point-to-point -point calls directly, no gateways to jump through or any bridges or anything else. So I can look at a buddy list here online and see who's available. So I'm going to call a conference room. So again, I just right click, start a call and away I go. I've connected to the room system directly, no gateways I need to hop through. And I can actually see the status has been updated. So I have my room here I'll connect to, I go full screen. And then we go, we actually go into a uh, full high definition on the Microsoft client. So again, supporting full HD between the Microsoft client and the Polycom room system. And if you wanted to share some content from the uh, room system straight into the link client, again, that's possible. Users can just click and share. So I've now taken out my video from the room and I'm displaying my content from whether it's VGA cable in the room or I'm using our people in contact application from Polycom, users can simply share content wherever they are, not a problem. So that's our sort of straightforward, simple native integration, point to point calling. Very simple for users to click and call. So to have an IM conversation, say, why don't we do video? And say, I'm in a conference room, not a problem. You click, click and join. The other piece then is if you want to go to multi party calling, and the Polycom systems can understand the Microsoft AV MCU. There are some limitations there where it's video switching and it's VGA quality. You may want everyone to have the best quality they can receive. So with the Polycom integration on our conference bridge, uh, again, the Polycom RMX bridge is natively integrated to Microsoft Link. So I, I've got a buddy list here as my virtual meeting room. So we will have a virtual meeting room within Polycom. I just right click to join. And then users from any other platform can join, whether it's a third party system. You microphone. You are the first person to join. I can also join with my iPad. Just lower the volume there. So I can join with my iPad, that's going to now join. After the tone, please state your name. I'll just mute that. So has joined the conference. We have my iPad in the call now. And I'm just going to bring in my iPhone. So again, multiple people can be in the call. So now we've got three people. Just that one. And then let's bring in the conference room. Let's not leave anyone out. They can join the call too. And I'll also bring in my desktop video client from Polycom, the CMA desktop. So I just click to join. So making it very easy for users to click and join and be in a virtual meeting room and get together and collaborate. So now my laptop client is coming in, that's muted, so that's fine. So now we have a four-way call, very easy for users to, to do video wherever they are. And sharing content, I'm able to do that from my iPad. Let's just select a document I've got here on my, on my folder. So again, any device will see this content. So even on my iPhone here, I've got the content and I'm able to pinch to zoom if I want to zoom in and see it more clearly. Very easy for users to be on the move and be part of that conference call. And just while we're here on, on the slide, we have um, over 40 devices from Polycom that integrate into the Microsoft Link environment all natively. So we also have the new CX7000, which is a, a Link room system. So Link user interface supplied by keyboard and mouse. So the familiar user interface that Link users are used to using, no remote control to use. But it's got the high definition optics from Polycom and also the high definition audio, so making that experience much, much better. Very simple for users to do a call from any device, you just meet on your virtual meeting room. Has left. We'll just hang all these up there. So, as you can see, very simple for users to do video wherever they are. So that's uh, direct point to point calls, content sharing, uh, multi point calls, content sharing. The next piece we have is our Outlook integration from the Outlook client into the Polycom platform. So I'll just double click to start a new entry. 
And up here we have our conference button. You click on this button and it generates a script that allows you to send out to users. So you may have used like meeting or similar in the past that you can click on a hyperlink and join the call. So this could be your virtual meeting room is set up or you can have ad hoc virtual meeting rooms so they change each time depending on what you want in your environment. But this template is totally customizable and I'll put in other items such as users can download the free trial of M100 if they want desktop video or again on their iPad or Android devices they can have links here to download. If you're not in a Polycom enabled meeting room or a third party room again you just dial in the same virtual meeting room if it's on your network or if they're outside your network they can just dial your video where firewall and straight into your, into your meeting room. The other piece of information here is the audio number so if people don't want to join my video or they don't have the bandwidth available wherever they are they can just join an audio so making it very simple for users to have one virtual meeting room in their organization not have a conference calling number for audio a different one for video a different one for something else it's just your one virtual meeting room number for any sort of calls you have and then even users have got the option to control their conference so with a password if they want to do it they can enable it in here, they can actually record and stream. So if you've missed the meeting, you want to go back and view it, there'll be a hyperlink in the record in the Outlook invite. Very simple for users to go and find it. We can also stream it out, so if you want people to view it on the web, you can have a hyperlink sent out in the in the invite that people can click on and watch the watch the stream. And then with this content recording we can take it off and put it into SharePoint um, automatically and have our SharePoint integration from our Real Presence media platform very easy for users to then search and index their, their uh, recordings and meetings. So that you think, great, you know, you get your reminder up, you can click on the link and join your conference call. What about people in the room system? So what we've done with um, our room systems is taken that and integrated it into the exchange calendar. So if I just bring up my home screen here, you can see that um, here's my standard home screen. You can customize these buttons on how you want them and we have our calendar so our calendar is natively integrated to exchange so it's using exchange web services it's got a user account and you're invited to a meeting like you would do normally and any meetings are in the diary uh, as you can see I've got a, a grey meeting which has been in the past normal meetings that um, don't have any video involved and then dive down here at four o'clock I've got my demo which I've just created and when I scroll down to it, it's got the join now button. So all you have to do is press the green button on the remote to join now or on the touch panel to join now. And it also works just like Outlook with reminders of 15 minutes, 10 minutes, 5 minutes. So people are all in the room previously, then I'll, the system will wake up and display a reminder. And then you can drill down and see the details of the conference a little bit further if you want to as well. But making it just one click away for users to, to join the meeting wherever they are. So that's it. There we have it. We, that's our integration to Microsoft where we have very simple native integration from the desktop client straight into um, room systems or conference bridges straight into the link server so users are just using their link client as the main desktop video application for IM presence voice video making it all very simple thanks for listening today any questions please feel free to reach out to me thanks have a good day